Cam, you've gone through Combine Pro Day now. What's the process been like so far? It's been a great process, man. You know, can't complain at all. Um, each and every single day, I try to take something away from it. Um, take something away from the people that I'm around because, um, you know, it's the highest of the highest, you know, the highest level. Um, you know, whether it's coaches I'm around or, you know, even elite players that I'm around. And, you know, the one thing I learned, you know, throughout this, high, this process that it takes 110% every single day. Um, no days off. Having drawn on that experience from already being online, were you able to kind of like help out your teammates and kind of lead the way through some of the things that these scouts were looking for? Oh yeah, definitely. Just tell them that, you know, scouts, they want to see, they want to see calm. They want to see you calm and see how you move. Um, and uh, kind of not, you know, even though it's a big moment, just don't let moments get too high um, or too low. I just, I just told them, just be yourself. Um, all these players, they're great players, they're great athletes, um, and they're my brothers. And, you know, I can't wait to play with them at the next level. And has there been a couple things you've especially focused on this offseason to try to improve your game? Yeah, I think that um, everybody here can run, everybody here can jump, but not everybody got you know the right mindset. And I always say um, the mindset is powerful. So each and every day I'm working on you know c controlling my mindset, um, uh, feeding my brain with positive things and blocking out the negative. Whether it's you know it's crazy because um, I started reading this this book by uh, David Goggins, um, crazy dude. You should look at him. Uh, and then also Inky Johnson, guys like that, guys that just motivators and um, you know attack every day. What's kind of the rest of the way look look like for you from here? Yeah, um, just how can I how can I grow myself uh, as an overall football player? Um, and you know, film is the next step. Film study, being able to process film, being able to you know look at the offense and tell what they're doing before they before they even do it. Because I always tell myself, you know, the offense tell a story. You just got to read it. So. What's been your favorite part or favorite aspect of the process so far? Uh, just being able to, you know, compete with myself every single day. Um, every single day is a challenge. From you know, when I when I stepped foot in Fort Myers, January second, um, uh, it was a goal every single day. Um, and, you, know, you just got to keep stacking bricks on bricks. And um, although I'm competing with these guys, you know, I'm competing with myself uh, also. So, hey, one or two more. I guess is there. Specific part of your game you feel like you could especially contribute at the next level if that's happening? Uh, I think that you know my offensive recognition is uh, you know elite. You know uh, you know not being able to play these uh, at the end back end of the season getting hurt week five. I was able to see football in a different lens. I was able to see football in a coach's perspective rather than a player's perspective. And I think that, you know, it took my game to a whole nother level. So I'm just thankful to have leaders like, you know, Coach Chad Will and Coach Tom Allen being able to, you know, help me learn the game of football outside of not playing football. Anything else? If not, thank you. Appreciate y'all.